Hi, this is Lady Nefertiti BK, and I thought I would come back and do a roller set because the last time I did a roller set on my own here was when it was relaxed. So I thought, well, I've been rolling my hair up almost every night now, now that the weather is much cooler. And so I figured, why not record what I do and what I'm using, right? Plus, I am. I'm like doing a type of hair diary, um, monitoring how my hair is growing, if what I'm doing is working or not, and sharing it with you guys. So you guys are watching uh, the health of my hair in real time. So you get to follow my journey with me, okay? So this is what I'm using. I use very little of this because I don't want my hair to revert. It is the Infusium 23 Pro, the original formula. I prefer the original formula. I get this from Sally's. I mentioned that before in one of my videos. And then um, after I put that on very, very light, like very light, I do not make my hair damp, just, you know, because it strengthens the hair. That's why I like it. And I'm going to use this Hollywood Beauty Jojoba Oil. It says it hydrates and conditions. It's only $2 and something. Um, I forgot where I got this from, but if you Google it, you can find out who, who has it now. But um, I think I got this from a beauty supply place. And I tried to show affordable items to you guys. Oh yeah, and the hairpins I'm going to use. Even though I, I bought this container from Dollar Tree, but this is the name of it. And this is sold at uh, Sally's and it comes in a plastic container, a see-through uh, plastic container. And they are large hairpins. I use this for any size uh, roller. It doesn't matter what size a roller is. I'm going to be using my small uh, green rollers. I remember I bought these, a whole pack of... What was it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. There's really 20, so there's a roller missing. A pack of 20. I got it for a dollar at Dollar Tree. I don't know if they're going to get them again, uh, but I made sure to get one because that was something else to get it for that price. And this is the size of the roller. So you'll see it's very small. And as my hair grows, you will see the rollers get larger when I roller set. Okay, oh, my scalp, Woo. Okay, take my glasses off because it never fails for me to knock it off my, my face. Okay, so what I do, I just put very little, and I'm not, it's very watery, so I'm not gonna be able to hold it up. And I rub my hands together, then I add it to my hair. Okay, uh-oh, still two hairpins in here. Anyway, I do it like that. Um, that keeps my hair strong. Then I add a little bit of oil, this oil here, and I add very little, about that much. Rub my hands together. I don't want my hair to be too oily, just enough. Okay, I do it like that. And then after I do that, I brush it out. And remember, I showed you this brush. They sell this at Walmart. Because I, I get people that ask me, well, where did you get that product? Could you let me know where you get that product? So I'm going to start mentioning where I get things in my video. Okay. All right. Okay. So what I do, once I do that, then... I just start grabbing here. I used to do my hair in sections, now I just grab it. So, and I do this. Most of the time I only use one hairpin, but lately my rollers have been uh, ending up in my scarf. My scarf will still be on my head, but the roller won't be on my hair anymore. Okay, now hold it in place.
So as you can see, I use two hairpins on each roller. I just started doing that. I've been using only one, but um, rollers ending up inside my scarf. That's no good to me in the morning. Now, towards the back of my head, I will use larger sections only because I pin my hair up in the back. And brush that out. I just like smaller sections in the front of my head because of how I wear my hair. Um, oh, and I wanted to show you this pick. This pick is the cutest thing. I got this from uh, Dollar Tree. Look at that. Yeah. Okay. Let me get serious again. Okay. And... And so you guys get to um, watch my hair journey. You get to actually see my hair journey. This will be the first time I have videoed my hair journey. I used to take pictures. You know, pictures used to show me the length of my hair. And when I started my hair journey back in 2008, and I was just getting the hang of it, and it was doing good, and then for a minute there, it just got really bad. It was sickly looking, I did something wrong, and then I dedicated myself to uh, wet roller sets, and uh, took it easy on the heat, next thing I knew, I had hair that was past my bra in about two years. But um, it started off good, then my hair was real, real thin, broken off bad, and then I got the hang of it. And I found out that roller sets was my best friend. You know, for my relaxed hair, it was, you know, shampoo, condition, put the leave-in in, and then roller set, and that's what did it for my hair. Okay. So what I did was I used the Shea Moisture, what was it, Shea Moisture? I showed it in my last, no, not my last video, video before last. I showed the shampoo that I've been using lately. The Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil one, I think. Then I used uh, Olaplex because my hair is colored. And when you color your hair, that is a chemical, and you want to get that pH right. You never want to color your hair and then just do what you do, because you could lose your hair seriously like that. So after I colored it, and I used a box color, I um, forget which one it was. I used a box color, used my Olaplex. Left my Olaplex in for about an hour because I was busy doing things. About an hour. Then I rinsed it out. Then I conditioned it with uh, Care Care for dry and itchy scalp because my scalp was driving me nuts. And uh, after I used that, then I used my uh, my Infusium Pro, my Infusion 23 Pro leave-in. Use that for strength, for added strength. Um, then I blow dried it, then I flat ironed it. And um, then I started rolling it up. And so that's what I've been doing. So since I'm, I am using a chemical, I color my hair. And so, and now I've discovered this new one that I will be reviewing soon that sold at Sally's called Ion, Ion Absolute Perfection Step 1, and then the Color Sealer Step 2, and I will be telling you guys about that. And I use that in the very front of my head. In case if it didn't work out, I could run and get my Olaplex. 
but it's so far so far it is good it's not olaplex but it's very good so far okay and i will show you the back just as soon as i am finished um i had a person ask me why don't you just speed up your video i'm sorry no so i'm going to <laughs> Finish this and um, put two ear pins right here. I do better when I'm not looking. Is it like that for anybody else out there? Do you do better when you're not looking at what you're doing? You feel your way and so you get better results. Okay, I feel like I missed something. I think I see it on the side, so I will be doing that one again. Okay. Um, when my hair first fell out, I couldn't even put it in a roller. My hair wouldn't even fit in a roller, and I didn't think there was any help for my hair. I thought, oh, well, it was nice having hair when I had it, right? And uh, so you can imagine how thrilled I am that I can actually put rollers in my hair, even though they're small rollers. I don't really care that they're small rollers. I'm gonna make this in a two. Um, I'm, I'm happy that I can put rollers in my hair in general, so it's okay. You'd be amazed at the little things you can be thankful for in life. I'm going to get another roller because I want to make this extra curly. And then when I take these rollers out in the morning, which will be one second for you guys, um, I'm going to take it down in front of you so you can see how my hair turns out. Oops. Did I just place that behind my neck? Wait a minute. Hold on. I'm getting goofy again, you guys. Okay, wait a minute. What am I missing here? Oh, I see what I'm going to have to do with that. Wrap it around the roller. That's what I'm going to have to do. And then put a regular hairpin on it. There we go. Okay, let me show you guys now. So this is how it's looking. Okay, a little crazy, but it works. So when I come back in the morning, I will... I will show you guys my results because um, I will have to leave real early in the morning. So, again, to show you what I roller set with, Infusing 23 Pro Original. That's my leave-in. My oil is the Jojoba Oil by Hollywood Beauty. And my Mega Grip Premium Roller Pins made for rollers. And I use them on all sizes. Okay, so that's everything I used. My brush that I get from Walmart, that I got from Walmart. My uh, pick, isn't that, that's just so cute. I got this from a Dollar Tree. Okay, so I will be back in the morning, and uh, that'll be, like I said, a second from now. Bye-bye. Hi, this is Lady Nefertiti BK. It is the next morning. And the reason why you see the same dress, I just put this on for the video yesterday and then I took it off and changed my clothes. So I decided I wanna actually wear this today. That's why I have the same dress on. Uh, I'm going to, uh, this is take two on this video, by the way. I'm getting really good with the take ones and take twos, right? Okay, so I'm going to be putting this Win 319 on my hair. I got this from my daughter. It is the Hair and Body Dry Oil Intensive Treatment Spray. So I'll be putting that on. I'm going to wear my black hair zine. I'm going to use regular hair pins, hair clips. And as you know, I had used these very long roller um, hair pins, two to a roller yesterday. I'm going to use my Walmart brush, my Dollar Tree pick, okay, 
That's how the bottom looks there. Okay, I've already taken one roller out <laughs> because my camera fell and I said, I'm not going to leave that in. Okay, so let me go ahead and take this stuff out. Let's see how my dry roller set turned out. Because as you know, when I was relaxed, I would do wet roller sets. <clears throat> I have somewhere to go in a little while. So I thought I would complete this video and then go have some breakfast and then take off. I hope everybody is doing good this morning. I remember these are the size rollers I used. And then I found out, um, I, I found out that uh, right now at my Dollar Tree, they don't have those rollers. Maybe they'll have them again in a month or two. So, as you know, different Dollar Trees sometimes carry different things. All right. And then I'll show you my curls before I start brushing. And I think it's so exciting that you guys get to follow my hair journey with me. So you get to see how my hair is doing step by step. Now, next month, I will be compiling a short video showing how my hair has grown uh, through the year. Okay, let me see. So then, take a couple sprays. That was silly, actually. Makes my hair really soft like a uh, silk. I take my glasses off, it never fails that I brush them off my face. I brush it all back. And the reason why I brush my hair back completely before I style it is because I go for a lot of body, and so that works for me. And then okay and then I will style that some more afterwards I'll take my hair oh and let me show the guys the back so that's what I did there okay then I'll take my brush brush it upwards because I never put edge control in the back. I only use edge control in the front. Because I don't want to cause any type of breakage in the back. Whereas in the front, I can see everything that's going on. And then I will turn around so you can see what I did. Do it like this. Then put my glasses on so I can see this really good. And then I'll put a pin here. Now, if I'm going somewhere special and I'm going to be gone all day, then I'll put hairspray on it. If I know I'm going to shampoo it and condition it that night, I think um, hairspray is very drying. 
So if I don't plan on shampooing and conditioning that evening, I won't use it. Okay, turn that like that. Now let me see, how's that looking? Looking in the mirror, you guys. Okay, then I'm gonna take my kerosene and put it on, let me feel. And then, and then this is where the clips come in for me because cer certain parts of my hair is really short. So I, even though it's growing out, I'm happy about it. Not like that. Okay, and then you see. And there you go. Now you see how my hair looks. And that's how I'm gonna wear it for the day. Thank you guys so much for watching. You have a wonderful, blessed day. Bye-bye.